What's up, what's up, what's up? This is your boy Zeke Dog, and I'm back with another video, man. So today, getting a little bit of hazmat, man. And it's going from it's Baymont, Texas, down to Houston, all the way up to Denver, Colorado. Let's see. All right. Looks like I'm lined up pretty good. I mean, I could be over two inches. Uh, I'm gonna see what they say. Well, you know what? Maybe I'll just do it anyway. I'm over here. Let me know I need to get closer to that have something as a ground guy and uh if you need a truck man go on over to long mountain man check out the inventory so you can find your next truck Alright, I think I got it perfect this time. But see, you don't have any lines out here. And then if you don't have lines, you just gotta kinda gauge it as best as possible. But I think I think we have perfection now. So uh, I'll put down there man it is a lot of land star truck over here I was gonna say trailers but trucks and trailers even though it's a lot of land star people I'll say that because land star don't own no trucks but it's a lot of land star people over here man a whole heck of a lot that's all I saw when I first pulled up Landstar, Landstar, Landstar. I said, oh, they, they booking loads over here. Somebody is booking loads. Yep. Everything going good with the truck, man. No major complaint. We can always complain about something, but no major complaints man I'm gonna be uh, content and enjoy where I'm at that part right there so this weekend man today Friday I got a motorcycle club event this weekend yes sir now I ain't been home all month it's going on three weeks so I hit up Miss Zeke doll I said baby you to come out here to Texas. She said, no problem, Mr. Zeke Dog. <laughs> I said, uh, Rue, Rue, Rue. <laughs> so, Miss Zeke Dog, she already on the way out here to meet me. And, uh, man, we just gonna enjoy the weekend. So, you know, the two things I gotta do when I'm on chill mode one, I gotta smoke me a nice cigar. <laughs> yes, sir. Number two, I gotta have me a good glass of those uh those corn oils. <laughs> yes sir. And uh yeah man I'm gonna chill, relax, and Sunday I'm gonna get on the road, knock out about 700 miles, shut down. I should still have about two more hours of hump, knock them out the next morning, and uh man, just keep this thing going. Man, dog team, we've been here for over three and a half hours. I done took a nap, everything, man. That's crazy. Like. Mm. 
All right, so that's what we got back here, man. Gotta list some of everything. After picking up my hazmat load, I made my way over to Colleen, Texas. This way I could participate in our annual festivities. The Colleen chapter always is very uh, hospitable. This weekend, we started out by hanging out at a local park. A lot of barbecue uh, games such as dominoes, which you can uh, see me beating down people on, on one of these tables over here and we also had uh, a few vendors out selling different items that a lot of bikers tend to uh, like to wear the weather was pretty good not too hot not too cold but definitely warm for October I think everywhere has been warm for October and I know y'all watching this video in November saying, Dang, Zeke, you still in October? Yeah, I'm still in October, man. But uh, the videos are are coming out faster now. So I'll have a little more time to get up to date. Y'all see me sitting at the table. Green hat, green shirt. Hard to miss with all the green on. We got some line dancing going on. A lot of family, a lot of kids out here. I think I scared a little man. And he said he was going to beat up my camera. So I had to run away. From the sky view, you can see uh, different parts of the park. We're kind of spread out over a few different places. Got a lot of motorcycles parked out here. Most of them look like they're Harleys. Which really doesn't matter what bike you ride. As long as you're on two wheels. Three is questionable. But two wheels, you're good to go. I'd love to come back here again uh, the next time we're in town. They found a pretty good spot for shade. The sun uh, is not too friendly when you're standing in it, but when you're in the shade, the weather's feeling good. We got a little cigar lounge in the trailer back here. I think I went in and uh, purchased a couple cigars. So later on that night, uh, we had our party. It was like a neon and glow kind of party. So a lot of glow sticks, a lot of uh, neon lights going on. Just trying to give y'all a little walkthrough of the crowd. I was sitting around with a nice drink enjoying myself uh, going to take a few pictures with friends socializing talking about how much of a great time the weekend has become but slowly knowing that the weekend will be over in a couple of hours getting ready to get back on the road to do what I love doing which is trucking but before I get back behind those 18 wheels, you know, I had to light up a nice cigar or two or three and just enjoy my time. A little tobacco and a couple drinks. All right, doll team, man, the weekend is over. Hopefully y'all enjoy, you know, seeing me kick it a little bit. I got the white waffle all primed up and ready to roll. Just got to load it back up with everything. 
but I had it all inside. Mm. Yes, sir. We ready to head on up to Colorado, but uh, we won't make it there tonight. Well, no, no, no. We'll make it, we'll make it to Colorado, but we won't make it to Denver. Let me let me clarify that. So uh, I'm about to get me some breakfast, man. But let me show y'all my shirt I just bought, man. I I seen a cat with this shirt, and I was like, man, I love it right here. So let's see if uh, I can let y'all see it. There we go. <laughs> man, hey, I seen that shirt. I said, man, I got to take a picture of it. And I went straight to Google Images and searched it. And found it and ordered it that night. So let me get me some coffee and some breakfast and I'm rolling out. All right, dog team, man, I done made it to my stop for the night. I've been rolling today, man. I uh, I done rolled about nine hours. But let me show y'all what I'm about to be dealing with now. So, a piece of this tire is, is coming off. This, this looks like one of those recap tires. And it's only right here in that one spot. Oh man. I mean I'm I'm still aired up. It ain't off. It hasn't blown. But it probably won't be long. <laughs> it won't be long till it's blown. Man, I'm, I'm parked where it's no shop at tonight. So, uh, what I'm going to try to do is get that baby in the shop tomorrow or some point. So after several hundred miles, I've made it to Denver, Colorado, the Mile High City. And uh, anytime I'm going up that way, I notice different things happening, such as my water bottles begin to expand. Uh, and when I leave the area, they begin to contract. My coffee pods, they expand as if they have extra air inside of them due to the change of the pressure. Um, where I'm delivering, you can tell it's an industrial area, a lot of train tracks nearby, as well as some additional factories, uh, industrial plants. You see a lot of other trucks out here making deliveries at different locations. But that's what goes on in the big cities. This is a pretty nice view of the surrounding area of Denver. And you can even see the downtown area. All the high rises. I really enjoy flying this drone around to see different scenery. Sometimes it allows you to see way more than what you can see just sitting inside your truck. I would have never known about all the other businesses and things they have going on in the area. 
but just looking around you can see one spot looks like a place where they dump garbage another spot looks like a lumber yard it's just so much in the area Dog team, man, it has gotten windy up here. Windy, so that means it gets cooler. And then, being in Denver, you know, it's the mile high city, so we're a mile above sea level. Yep, I need to get that hole fixed. That's not good. Keep getting patched up and keep uh, opening back up. So. Oh man, it's always something. But it's been, I don't know if y'all can notice, there's a little bit of rust here. And on the inside, you can see more rust. And that's just a sign of it's been like that for a while. Water's been getting in this trailer for a while. It's always something, man. Always something. But we've come to the end of this journey. So appreciate y'all checking out these videos, man. Like, share, subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. And join the dog team. So, to the next time, baby, keep it trucking.